I said, can you recommend some music for a kid's party? He said, small faces. I said, of course they have the kids. <laughs> My mum and dad are complete opposites. You couldn't hope to meet two such totally different blokes. <laughs> My local police chief does a talk on heroin, so you can't understand any of it. <laughs> Do you know, I was mugged recently. I was at Victoria Station and I was mugged and I burst into tears. And a policeman came up to me, he said, I'm fining you £10. I said, for crying out loud, he said, yes. <laughs> so I gave him a description of the mugger, and he built up a photo fit. And when I looked at it, it looked exactly like me. So he took me in for questioning. He said, where were you at five o'clock? I said, I was at Victoria Station. He said, it's not looking good, is it? <laughs> I said, I've got to go to court on a drink driving charge. He said, is it the old Bailey? I said, no, Harvest Bristol Cream. He said, why don't you drink non-alcoholic wine? I said, slur. He said, why don't you drink non-alcoholic wine? <laughs> Tequila, schnapps, sambuca. I'm calling the shots. <laughs> so I went to Alcoholics Anonymous. I said, I can't stop gambling. He said, you want Gamblers Anonymous? I said, you're probably right. I'm so drunk that I am. <laughs> I saw this sign. It said, hairdressing for men. I walked in. There was a rabbit trying on clothes. And all these blows going, yeah, very nice. So I went to the cinema, I saw a very sad film, and the bloke behind me suddenly started wailing. I got hit in the back of the head with the harpoon. <laughs> but you know, I love, I love reading. At the moment, I'm reading My Life by Bill Clinton, which freaked me out, because I didn't know he knew anything about my life. <laughs> and this bloke said to me, he said, I've got bubonic plague. I said, don't give me that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'll leave you with this. Um, well, I didn't bring it with me. <laughs> Today I had dinner with my boss and his wife, and it was a complete disaster. My boss's wife said to me, she said, Tim, how many potatoes would you like? I said, I'll just have one. She says, all right, you don't have to be polite. I said, all right then, I'll just have one, you stupid cow.